hey everyone welcome back to the channel today we're gonna be diving into the highly anticipated infinix note 40. i'll show you the unboxing review some of its features and dive deep into what makes this smartphone um, stand out so let's get started first things first let's see what's inside the box um Inside the box, you find the usual suspects, a SIM ejector tool, documents, um, screen protector, a sticker, um, a case, which is not a transparent case this time, a 45 watt power brick, which can do fast charging anyway, and then USB-C charging cable, and finally the phone. Let's take a closer look at the Infinix Note 40 itself. Um, the design is sleek and modern, featuring a 6.8 inch Full HD display with a smooth 120Hz refresh rate, which is perfect for gaming and multimedia consumption. But please don't play the um, COD uh, Warzone on this phone. It can actually carry it, but the quality will have to be set to the lowest possible quality and um, you might not really enjoy that. You need to use higher end uh, flagship devices from um, the big dogs, the big companies um, to play that. I've even gotten complaints from iPhone um, 12 users that theirs is lagging. So probably from the 14 Pro and 15 Pro, you should get good performance. And But this is not about Call of Duty. Let's get back to the Infinix. So under the hood, the Note 40 packs a punch with its MediaTek Dimensity. 1200 chipset paired with uh, 8 gigs of RAM, ensuring seamless performance for multitasking and gaming. Um, on the back, we have a quad camera setup featuring a 108 megapixel primary sensor, an 8 megapixel ultra wide lens, and a 2 megapixel depth sensor, and a 2 megapixel macro lens. That's four cameras. This setup allows for stunning photography. In various scenarios. For selfie enthusiasts, the Infinix Note 40 sports a 32 megapixel front facing camera capable of um, capturing sharp and detailed selfies. Um, this is not a full review, so I wouldn't be um, doing a camera test or talking so much about the cameras. Um, now let's talk about battery life and battery charging and everything. With its massive 5000 milliamp hour battery and efficient software optimization, the Note 40 easily lasts through a full day of heavy usage. Yeah, 5000 is cool. It's amazing for um, phones. I mean, that's just the perfect spot. I've seen some phones with 6000 milliamp hours. I think that's kind of too much, but it's still going to be okay, especially in countries um, like Nigeria, where power supply is not that stable. And you can't trust the electricity distribution companies to um, always give light or electricity. So yeah, you need high battery specifications in quotes. And connectivity wise, the Note 40 supports 5G, ensuring blazing fast internet speeds wherever you go. Before I conclude, there is an important feature of the Infinix Note 40 that I want to talk about, and that is the wireless charging. Now it has a MagSafe um, charger which um, charges wirelessly and so yeah if you don't want to use the, um, the charging cable you can use the MagSafe charger and it supports that. You can also charge other devices with your Infinix phone. Devices that are QI compatible you can charge them with um, your Infinix device wirelessly by placing them on top of um, each other and also charge your infinix boards and the other stuff okay the infinix note 40 impresses with its stunning display powerful performance versatile cameras long-lasting battery life and 5g connectivity at its price point it offers incredible value for money um, that wraps up the review and unboxing of the Infinix Note 40. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. 
for more content. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.